<coughs> Damn coughing. We've left those sands long ago, and it still persists. <coughs> what does Crest even smoke? <laughs> it's terrible. In any case, I'm better now. I hate to interrupt, guys, but uh, you should come to the mess hall. The table is almost served. Thanks, Stepan. We'll be there in a moment. Shall we go, Artyom? Or shall we stay a little longer? It's so nice. You know, Artyom, I've been looking at Stepan and Katya, you and me, and thinking how lucky we are. It was so different with my parents. It was bad. Did I ever tell you why my mom died? Of course I didn't. It was because of Dad. He used to be even harsher back then. He used to come home from the barracks and reach for the bottle while taking off his boots. They'd quarrel, and then he'd stop appearing for a time. And while he was away, she'd start drinking too, and crying when she was sober. She'd feel better, would get kinda dreamy when drunk. You know how she used to call me, just A. She'd hug me and say, one day, A, you and I are going to go to Vladivostok, the city I was born in, and from there to a village on the ocean shore. I was five back then and didn't really get much, but I could imagine that village and the ocean so vividly because I believed her. Go, Artyom. I'll rest some more and join you later. Everything is perfect, Artyom. Follow us. should have seen them Jesus dance. Christ. Don't you worry. You'll get this another chance. A moment of your attention, please. Half a year on the road, and 4,000 clicks behind us. We have been through a lot. Damir. Alright, people. I do understand I can't keep it a secret much longer. After a careful study of the satellite maps we've obtained, <laughs> and much deliberation, we've found a place we could call our new home. <coughs> it is a river valley. There's forest and a hydroelectric power plant. Yeah. This place is quite far from densely populated areas, which, as our journey has proven, is important. We're about two days away from it now. So, Congratulations, yeah. 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 yeah! Yet, uh, this is not our last order of business for today. Stepan, Katya. Oh, Prince! Stepan, Katya, repeat after me. I take you to be my spouse. I take you to be my spouse. And vow to hold you from this day forward. And vow to for hold you from this day for worse, for better or for worse. For richer, <laughs> for poorer. For richer, for poorer. In sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. To love and to cherish to and to until death do us part. A 
as the captain of this ship, I hereby pronounce you husband and wife. Live long and be happy. Oh, and Gorka! 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 Oh! What's happening? Be careful, people! Anna, please hold on to it. What's happening? What is it, Anna? What's that cough? Gotcha. Do something, please! Don't this have her! Good. Give her air! Damn! I'm sorry, I didn't say anything. What are you talking about, baby? In the Yamantau. When they dragged me away, <laughs> that ghoul doctor said my lungs were falling apart. The gas I breathed in that ammo dump said How I don't have lungs. How can you believe that monster? We've just been through a desert and all that sand, so that might be the reason. Katya, Artyom, a few words. Go. I'm fine now. I don't know about this. You don't know this purpose. So, son, care to tell me what Arno, do we do please. now? Let us not panic and think constructively. So, Katya, what do you think? I think that trusting some degenerate's diagnosis wouldn't be wise. A move from humid metro into the desert with its dry heat and sandstorms is a stress for us. Yes, I do think she'd be hit really bad right off the start had it my been My thoughts gas. exactly. Thus, first I'll check her condition to the best of my knowledge. Also, we're approaching the valley with its forest air. That alone could heal her. I'm sorry to intervene, but did something happen? Ah, oh, Anna coughed out some blood. My god. Do you really think it's the sand? Sounds more like a TB to me. That's for sure. TB we can handle. We've got enough antibiotics, and air does help with that. What if... What if that degenerate was right, Katya? What do we do? Is there medicine? There was an air defense battery station in our village. Right on the brink of war, they received a new draw. It saved a lot of people after gas exposure and general poisoning. I'll check my mom's records and find its name. I think it was produced in Novosibirsk. Right, Novosibirsk. Yermak, your opinion. For Anna's sake, I'd go to the edges of the earth. As for Novosibirsk, it's about 2,000 clicks. Then it's decided. We head for the valley. If it is suitable, we settle there. If our state worsens, I'll take a group of volunteers to find that drug. So Katya, please, find that name for I'll us. I'll find it. Don't worry. One more thing, Artyom. I want no surprises in that valley. You are our most seasoned scout. So take the rail car, one volunteer, Go check everything out before we arrive. Let's go back for now. Tell Anna and the people to calm down. Poor girl. Now I understand why she was so down with me. Just imagine thinking about all that for so long. So, what is the jury's verdict? <laughs> now here are your orders, everyone. First of all, stay calm. The plan stands. We head for that valley with its fresh air and clean water. Then we go about settling there. If Anna's health... Dad, please. I repeat, Anna, in case you start getting worse, there's a drug Katya told us about, so we can go and find it for you, if it is needed. Hmm, that sounds like a great plan. I'd also like to say this. Guys, please don't worry. 
I've been feeling pretty bad as it is for ruining the party. Oh, come on. You didn't ruin anything. I just brought myself down to rock bottom over that bastard from Yamantau. Though it must just be the sand and desert climate. Of course that must be it. We were discussing exactly that just now. All right. A toast. To you guys. Just be happy together. Right. To you. Great toast. Will you play that song about us? Get to the Приехал на фронт со своей молодой женой Полковник Васин созвал свой полк и сказал им Пойдем домой Мы ведем войну уже 70 лет Нас учили, что жизнь это бой Но по новым данным разведки Мы воевали сами с собой Я видел генерала Они пьют и едят нашу смерть и дети сходят с ума от того, что им нечего больше хотеть. А земля лежит в ржавчине, церкви смешали с собой. И если мы хотим, чтобы возможно вернуться, время вернуться домой. Это твой планет. I can't say I've ever been religious. But right now I'm begging all gods, please, watch over Anna and make the valley cure her of her affliction. In the meantime, Alyosha and I are on a recon mission. We have no idea of what is waiting for us there. Though Alyosha seems convinced that there are going to be crowds of women eagerly anticipating his arrival. If that turns out to be the case, then I have the best companion possible for this mission. Yes, I must say, I'm rather partial to this valley. Take care for one. Makes your head swim. Never smelled air like this in my life. I bet if we spend a week there, it won't just cure Anna. It'll make Colonel grow his feet back. Damn, this is one bumpy ride. The rails are all bent. The whole track seems to be fixing to slide down. I sure hope it can hold our weight. Let's hail the Aurora and tell them to take the other road. Come in, Aurora. This is forward recon. Do you read? Over. Colonel, sir. This track won't hold the Aurora. Take the main one. Over. situation is completely awesome, Colonel. Sir, Anna is sure to love it here. Over. So the plan goes like this. We get to that dam, check it out quickly, and call them over. Just take a look at all this beauty, huh? Don't you want them to see it sooner? Look at that church for me.
caught your friend, but I can see you two are not bandits. I'll help you out if you don't do anything stupid. You've got to run now. Just stay out of sight and you'll be fine. Catch you later. I owe you a big one, and I'll never forget this, I swear! Ah, these forest fuckers just left me here for the wolves!
Avast! Stop right there! It's the brethren of the coaster! Take another step and we run our rig on you! Aye! Another step and you die! <laughs> yeah, so beat it, you scallywag! If you know what's good for your ground-loving ass! Even one of you drifters we caught today is too much! Aye! Be a good doggy and get lost! <laughs> Look, I've been thinking about asking you all this time. All this pirate stuff, the corpses on the post. Do you guys really think the teacher wanted this? The teacher wanted us to defend ourselves. Well, none of this stuff helps. The bandits have been seen in the village again. Plus, our guys caught a drifter today. This just means they need us to remind them the lesson. That's why we're here. We'll catch a couple and make some fresh scarecrows. Well, bandits, I do understand. They did terrible things here. But this new drifter doesn't look like a bandit. Perhaps he was just passing by. If he is not a bandit, he should have just passed us by. But no, he crawled out of the river here. I say make a scarecrow out of him and keep the others away. I don't know about this, really. with the 
pioneers. Do you even believe that grew up together and the teacher thought was all the same? But look at them now, they're all cowards. Besides, how would they know? Well, they're probably picking on us all the time, but right? we're picking on them. What is it? What's up? Alyosha, come in. <coughs> we keep trying to contact you. What happened? Yeah, all right. Let's cut the rope and take him to the camp with the first one. Hey, wait a minute. You pioneers already have one, and this is our catch. He got caught on our turf. The net is mine, so bite me. Oh, yeah? Well, why did you set the trap on our turf, then? Uh, besides, you already have an intruder's backpack. I dived for the backpack, and you chickened out. Oh, I chickened out? You're pirates! You have more boats! And this one will face the forest court! Bojumoy, you are all cowards! He's an intruder, an enemy! What are you, a bandit? What did the teacher say? He said we must be different. Did you forget? Uh, isn't your head getting a bit too big? 
The teacher said we have to defend ourselves first. All the rest was later. Did you forget what the intruders would do here? He's an intruder too, so he must die before he brings the others. Enough! The forest court comes first. The court will decide if we kill him. <laughs> So you got out, you asshole. It takes real skill to get away from the master of the forest. This means you're dangerous. Damn it. Fucking backpack. I got greedy. I got greedy. Well, shoot me. Or scram. I gotta get ready. For the final exam. What do you think? He took a hit from the master. The master probably got you into it. You went to the camp, we came here. It all took time. So what? We must at least get the bodies back. We'd be called cowards if we don't. Yep. Let's push it then. Yeah. Tell me one thing though. How did you guys manage not to see the master? He can walk silently. And we were distracted. Another intruder got caught in the trap. And Eugene got excited, started demanding all the loot, or at least the food. Another intruder?
engine somewhere instead of wasting time. I just finished the patrol and then now enjoying my free time. So get off my face! Shut up! <laughs> Stay there, I don't care. Nobody cares. You'll see, it will blow everyone's mind when it talks. <laughs> That fucker. <laughs> 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 
So you're not one of them, I see. Uh, thanks for saving us, stranger.
Freeze, Drifter! So, we meet again? Though I bet you don't remember who dragged you out of the water. My name is Olga, by the way. Was it you fighting the Master of the Forest? Awesome. Our hunters had been staying away from him for years. Damn it! Sorry, teacher. The locks all rusted up. Your friend Alyosha is already at the dam. He said your cardinal won't wait, so you don't have much time. Sorry, I can't take you there. At today's council session, the pirates moved to attack your train. But they had no right to even call one without me present. As usual, I need to go and sort this out. But I have a few minutes to give you some directions. You need a boat to get to the dam. And our pirates keep all the boats at their swamp camp. They are not the sharing kind, but that's no reason to attack. Nobody wants bloodshed, so just stay out of their sight. Take the road to the barricade. Go down to the swamp and find the dock. That's where Alosha and I took the boat from. Peter, forgive me. There are some left, but be careful. Well, Drifter, take care. And don't make me sorry I helped you people. Tell Alosha I said hi. I'll stay a bit longer to tend to the grave of the teacher.
I'm not kidding. Who cares about becoming an instructor anyways? What's that? Ah, nobody. An intruder? Who's there? Ah, it was just me, I guess. From where would an intruder appear here anyway? This is... Nobody. Well, good.
Teacher said, courtesy distinguishes us from bandits and other animals. Wait a moment. You're not one of ours. A bandit, then. Don't look like one. Though you never know with them bandits. Different shit every day. Am I right or what, Senya? You're always right, Admiral, sir. Uh, put a sock in it. Your nose is brown enough. Where was I? Ah, the bandit! Well, you're here. Which means that all those spineless worms and wannabe pirates are all dead. Am I right? Don't bother answering. Everyone knows I'm right. And good riddance, I say. Perhaps we should offer him our hospitality, Admiral, sir? He is a guest, even though he's a bandit. Ah, that's an idea. Take a seat, bandit. Let's have some tea. I bet you never tried anything quite like it. I gathered, dried, and brewed it myself. Can't get any help from this worthless lot. At least, they don't eat much. Hey, boys! Yeah! Trying our best, Admiral, sir! Ah, quit your yapping. Making a worse racket than the damn aquas in heat. No respect for our guest, either. He can't get a word in edgewise. Don't mind them. To our meeting. That's a good tea. The fussy, ground-loving rats don't drink it, though. Radiation! Radiation! Radiation, my ass! Radiation. Just look at us! Dangerous. We're all healthy as can be! <laughs> Thanks for coming here. See how happy my boys are? We don't really have anyone to talk to here anymore. They all left We're all the forgotten here. Even Roman forgot about us. Yet he was here with us when we built this base. All the boys remember that, don't you now? Yes, he was here! I remember. We all remember. That's right, boys. You all remember. But that bastard just forgot! And the other ground-loving rats, too! They all forgot we're protecting them all with our lives here. At first, they were so happy. They shouted, We'll kill all the bandits! The pioneers are cowards! The teacher is wrong! We're better off attacking! Didn't they, boys? Yeah, they did! They shouted their throats sore! Yeah, louder than those bandits we shot! There you have it. My boys do remember. And those don't. You could always count on them when you wanted someone to shout and call pioneers names. Aye, but when the going got tough and the Aquas started attacking in their hundreds, they changed their tune. Oh, radiation. Oh, it's dangerous. Oh, the girls say teacher told them to tell us that we have to get out. Well, fighting the Aquas ain't as fun as hanging bandits from the posts. You can rob the bandits when you kill them, but mutants don't have much worth taking. So who cares if they're about to eat the whole valley, right? Pathetic rats. That's who they rats. are. Ground-loving rats. 
A bit late to start listening to the teacher, too. Though, those rats don't care whom they listen to. Be it teacher, or the girls. If doing so gives them an excuse for chickening out.
get some! Hakiom? Damn, you're alive! I'm so glad to see you. And I just managed to get in contact with the Aurora. They are worried. And I get that. This place isn't as simple as it first seemed. Come, I'll show you. Let's go, Artyom. Hear the counter react? There's a hell of a lot of radioactive sediment behind that concrete. And soon, it will bring an end to this valley. Because the dam barely holds. Use your binoculars if you don't believe me. We can't stay here. Nobody can, really. Ah, well... See that zipline? Those kids built it, back when there wasn't as much seepage. That's where we need to go. The old man said the Aurora will soon be on the dam. We gotta hurry! I think something's wrong at the Aurora. It seems that Anna is not here. We'll know more soon. Come on, Artyom! I kept telling you people about my animal magnetism. Restore this line's tension. 
you people. They just needed passage. Are you sure you're not coming? I'm sorry, Alyosha. I can't just stop and leave like this. No matter how much I like you. In this case, I bid you farewell, my fair lady. God, hell with it. Olga, I'll be back. I'll be waiting. Artyom, let's go! Olga! Remember what I told you! Get them out of the valley! There's death behind the dam! I just hope she convinces them! They are stubborn like you! we found along the way are of any help now. The illness has progressed too far. Come, 